when it comes to optimization, when it comes to Facebook ads objective, certain objective has got different optimization. As in like, let's say for example, when it comes to traffic objective, all right? When you come to traffic objective, you have the option to choose either link click or landing page view or you know impressions or daily daily unique reach. Now the impressions and daily unique reach are essentially you know to help you get either more people to view or you know everybody who comes online will only see the ads once. You just need to go in and read the, the description. But what is the really confusing here is you know the link click and landing page view. Which one should you be choosing? Now the essential thing to look at is this. If you do not have your Facebook pixel installed in the landing page, as in like the destination that you're trying to drive people into, you don't go for landing page view. Put it this way, example, if you're driving people to visit your Shopee store, all right, when you're trying to drive people to your Shopee store, you know for a fact that you do not have your Facebook pixel installed on your Shopee store unless you have CPass. But if you don't have CPass, you want to make sure that you're going for click. So the, choosing the right optimization is really important. Now, the other example that we have here is like, for example, when you're choosing conversion objective, all right? When you're going for conversion objective, there are different kind of optimization, as in like which conversion you're optimizing for. Now, a lot of people, when it comes to conversion, they will get excited and say that, oh, I know this is what I want. I want to go for uh, purchase. But what Facebook would say that if you do not have enough conversion event in, in the last seven days, you don't go for a purchase. You go a level up to see whether you have, I mean, the bottom line is 25 based on what we learned. You need to have 25 purchase in the last seven days. Then only you're able to optimize for purchase because Facebook needs data to find other people that might take to do the same thing. So essentially, if you don't have 25 purchase, you move a level up to see whether you have 25 people added to cart. If you don't have that, move out a layer and say if you have 25 people initiated, I mean, initiated checkout or view product. So you have to find the right optimization. That's why essentially it is about choosing the right objective as well as the right optimization for your campaign in order for the machine learning to help you find or to help you achieve the best result for your Facebook ads campaign.